This may seem like a silly question, but what the hell's going on? I'm not too sure anymore. Just a clue? I was going to sell you back to Mummy Dearest for a million bucks. But now she's been charged with the murder of Jake Sanders. It doesn't seem much point. What are you talking about? She didn't do it. Jilly did. And even that was sort of an accident. You mean you've got pictures? But why? What? Who the hell are you? My name's Chris. <laughs> they won't help you. I'm your half-brother, Dennis. The one that Stephanie abandoned when she was 18. Well, it wasn't quite like that. So, you're a Marv's son. You could get a lot more than a million bucks. <laughs> you mean if I don't kill you? Why would you bother with the hair if you wanted to do that? God knows, I've thought about it enough. You'll kill us both! Throw it! It's just a dummy. Makes three of us. I said I didn't want to see anyone. <laughs> then I'll see you at the trial. Although I don't think I'll be much help. I don't have to put up with this. Get her out of here! <laughs> I think prison grey will suit you somehow. But then it was never my colour either. Do you know how ridiculous you are? Not as simple as that. Now hang on. Hi, Mum. <laughs> Auntie Julie. Your hair. I know, I know. I'm never going to let Barbara again. Now look, this may come as a bit of a shock. But I guess you're used to those. Mum, I'd like you to meet Chris. Your son. What? He was on the balcony when Jilly shot Jake. Oh, come on! And he's got pictures to prove it. It's ridiculous. He's made a full statement, Mr. Sanders. I'm afraid we're going to have to ask you a few more questions. Oh, no! No, you can't do this to me! Let go of me! In a bucket of manure, you'd come up smelling of roses. You bitch! Go! I guess we have quite a lot of talking to do. <laughs> Waiting for you at Eden. He and Jessica didn't go. A miles at the Regent. I rang him about Chris. He wants to see you too. What do you want to do? For the moment, just walk. The serious decisions can wait a while. You know, I suddenly realise what freedom means. Heaven help anyone who tries to take it from me again.